if you really love Castlevania Symphony of the Night or the Metro games on the Game Boy Advance, then this game is for you. This is pretty much a Contravania. And I absolutely had a blast with this game. I really love this game. It was well worth the $20. And uh, I believe a lot of people are going to be turned off because it's $20. You know, it's pretty steep, but the content is there. It took me about six hours to complete the game, but I did not 100% the game. And then add trophies and all that. If you want to get a platinum, this game will probably be um, between six to eight hours. Depending on skill, maybe perhaps more. Because some of the bosses and even the level designs where the enemies are placed is quite challenging. But uh, overall, this game is fun as hell. I absolutely had a blast. This was a total surprise. And I really, really enjoyed this game tremendously. Graphically, it's beautiful. The soundtrack is fantastic. And everything about this game just... Like, it just screams old school. Old school, man, and I absolutely adored this game. This was a very nice surprise. And like I said before, $20 may turn you off, but it was totally worth it, at least for me. So this is my review of The Mummy The Mastered, and I hope to see WayForward to create more games like this besides, you know, what they originally do, like Sade or whatever. It's it's good to see them do, do something different. And uh, Konami, if you're watching, let them make a Castlevania game for you. This this company is awesome. So thanks for watching guys. You guys have a great day.